Hey guys, what is going on my ladies and gentlemen? Alex here back again, bringing you guys on a Lego time-lapse Lego video of set 10259. Well, as you can see, this is the winter train station. And we're gonna add this together with a Lego Christmas train. And we're gonna see how it turns out till the end. I would also really like to add this to a Christmas village mark or something that I've started, of course, last year. I would really like to bring that series back uh, to you guys and kind of be continuing a little bit on that build. Because I never felt I was completely done with it last year. But anyway guys, let us go right into the build. I can't truly wait. Let's do this right now. Alright guys, this was a pretty epic build, and as you can see in front of me here now, we got the set all completed, with the train station, the train track, and even the bus itself. Let's take a look closer on this set right now. Alright, so we're starting with a little bus, and I must tell you that I'm truly happy with the design of this. Absolutely an amazing look. We're going to take off the roof and inside you can see the bus driver and there is three more seats where people can possibly sit. On that I absolutely love the yellow color scheme on the, on the side of it and in general just a really nice build that I absolutely think is perfect developed by Lego. And what I'm, what I'm most like about it is that it is possibly a perfect LEGO scale bus for LEGO minifigures and to fit in together nicely with the rest of the other model as well. The bus itself is not taking too much attention to actually the train station and this is something I really do like. Alright, so let's go directly to the train station. The minifigures we're gonna get all the way uh, or on the way as well. We got a little kid outside here together with a grandmother and I absolutely love this little ticket stand here, absolutely phenomenal. The clock itself on the sides are actually some great pieces added. I was actually very surprised myself when I discovered this. But the piece that is used for the clock is the same piece that is used for the Captain America's shield in the LEGO model set. It is absolutely a great way to use this technique. Because what you possibly can do is just use a hinge piece, connect the shield piece onto it, and then put it on a stud that can face into the wall. Alright, so we can possibly now get a quick look on the bus at the same time as the clock design. I believe now it is time to go inside the door to figure out what possibly hides in here. Can we find some Christmas things inside here? That is the big question that we will reveal in the next couple of seconds. I would say the answer to that is yes. We can indeed find some Christmas things in here. We can basically just turn to the left and see this little Christmas tree up here that hides up there. Other than that, we can also see a woman down here make sure that all this, everything is going alright on the cafeteria. We also have a controller on onto the tickets to the train. And here we can see where the, where the train is gonna head. We can see the North Pole and at the bottom the South Pole. And of course at the last scene I just had to include the Lego Christmas train that I built last year. I actually expanded this with another reel at the back. And I'm really happy how that turned out, absolutely. I think it looks so much greater to a minifigure scale right now. Uh, same time as it looks very good next to the winter station itself. 
I believe I will continue on the Christmas um, village that I started last year. Can't guarantee I'm gonna do it entirely finished, but I'm definitely gonna make some really cool Christmas scenes. Well, anyway guys, I'm not gonna say anything more of my plans. I believe just have to wait and see how it's gonna turn out. And yeah, that's about it. Tell me guys what you thought about this Lego video. And I'll see you all guys later. Bye for now.